In this short video, I'm going to talk about how to achieve long-range wireless video transmission. Video transmission will depend on line of sight. You're pretty much not going to get long-range unless your antennas can see each other. And that may be quite a ways off in the distance, but still, they should have a line of sight. And line of sight also is not exactly what you might think. If you look at these buildings, you see the antennas where technically they have a line of sight. However, due to the placement of the antenna, the signal is going to bounce off the roof of the building, or it'll either totally miss the, the receiving antenna or arrive at a different time. It'll take longer to get there. And of course, if the signals arrive 180 degrees out of phase with the, uh, the direct signal, it can totally cancel out and therefore you'll have poor picture or no picture at all. So the solution is to actually raise your antenna and ideally you'll raise it 15 to 20 feet above any kind of obstruction. And uh, you can see in this second picture here that the uh, top antenna is uh, communicating just fine. Or you can see we also move it to the edge of the building, the antennas, and everything is fine. In this second illustration, even though there is line of sight, once again, now there's a building in the way and some of the signal is going to be reflected off that building. Uh, once again, the solution is to get 15 to 20 feet above the building and then everything would be fine. And the buildings and obstructions are not the only thing you need to worry about. The ground is also considered an obstruction because signals here you can see are bouncing off the ground. And here you can see the different ranges available. And if you want to get 100% potential, you're going to raise the antenna 20 feet of above any obstructions. Now, if you're not trying to go a long ways, then you know maybe it's okay at 10 feet, 5 feet, or it'll be all right. But to get maximum range, you're going to have to be around 20 feet above obstructions. And obstructions include trees. So here you can see in the summer, the uh, leaves on a tree can actually block wireless signals. So that they'll just bounce right off the uh, moisture-laden leaves. Whereas in the winter time, once the leaves are gone, the signal may be fine. So you have to factor in any kind of vegetation in the way of line of sight as well. Then there are issues with moving things. So here on a truck scale, you got the truck, it pulls up and it blocks the signal. So once again, you got to raise the antenna above where the trucks or any other obstructions that might move in the way. Now we have a package of two access points and a camera. What you do is connect, set one access point to transmit and you connect it to a network router or it could be an ethernet switch. It's powered by an included 24 volt DC PoE injector, which is power over ethernet. So it gets its power right off the ethernet cable or the cat5 cable and that's the receiving side so on the other side you have another access point and it is set to transmit and on this side it's probably going to end up being outside so you put everything inside an electrical junction box i mean or the power part of it junction box has a, an ac outlet and once again this has a 24 volt POE injector included. And then there's one for the camera. It also requires a POE injector. So that one's a standard 802.3AF, which means it uh, auto detects what voltage the camera needs and gives it the proper voltage. And then you have to have some way of viewing what's on the camera. But good news is once this is all on the network, you can use free software or like PCs or laptops, or there's uh, free or cheap apps for your mobile phones, or you could use a low cost Android tablet and just have it permanently monitoring. And of course you can connect DVRs or digital video recorders to record all the activity that's going on. So yeah, take a look at the, uh, the kits we've got available, and if you want to get long-range video, this is the way to do it.